Here's the question. Have home sellers in Lincoln lost $21,000 in equity? And if you're a buyer, how do you take advantage? We'll find out in this video. Hello, my name is Brandon Leone. I'm about to hit you with a Lincoln, California homes for sale market update for the month of June, 2022. Let's get started. Right now in Lincoln, California, there's 153 homes for sale. There's 106 houses pending and 96 that have sold this last month. So before I get into this too deep, just think about the real estate landscape. We have political stuff going on. We have the heat of summer. Families are out there enjoying themselves. We have the raising interest rates, right? There's a lot of factors right now and sellers are used to getting everything they want. So now we are heading into a more stable market. Anytime you have more houses hitting the market, you have less buyers, you have less, less houses going pending and less houses selling each month, you're going to have an adjustment. And we were due for an adjustment. We just came out of the craziest real estate market you've ever seen and now we're just normalizing. If you look back at numbers pre-COVID, you can see that we are similar numbers to that. So in Lincoln, we have 24 more houses listed now than we did this time last month. So a slight increase in that. The average price for a square foot in Lincoln right now is $351. Now that's actually up $7 from last month. How do you have more houses listed? How do you have houses selling for less? And how do you have the average price per square foot go up? Well, it depends. It's an average of all the houses sold. So everything from the thousand foot square foot houses to the 4,000 square foot houses. So it's slightly gone up, which is a good sign for Lincoln. So are the houses selling for what they were actually listed for? We've actually gone down for the first time in a long time. We're down to 99%. So if a house is listed for easy math, 100,000, good luck. And it sells for 99,000. So they're selling for 99% right now. And when you look in the days on market, they've increased everywhere in Placer County. So right now we're at 16 days on market. Last month was 13 days on market. They're going to creep up a little more and more. So if you're a seller, just know that it may take a few more weeks to sell your house than normal. Right now we are at 1.6 months of inventory, meaning if we listed no other homes in Lincoln, we'd sell out. Now, don't be afraid of this because one to three months is still gonna be a seller's market. Once we get to four months, that's considered more of a stable market. So if you are a seller, just being realist realistic and knowing exactly how long your house is taking to sell and making sure that it's priced right at the beginning, and uh, here's a hot tip for you. In, in all the listings that we're taking, we are recommending our sellers to list slightly under the market value. And that's gonna get more people into your house and that's gonna give you a chance to sell for more money. So if you're looking at selling your house, it's not necessarily about taking less than you think the house is worth. It's really the mindset of saying, how can I get the most buyers into my house right now with this shifting market and how can I make the most amount of money? So that's a hot tip for you. But at 16 days on market is the average. We're up uh, three or four from last month and it's continually going up. And so sellers need to be just a little more realistic on the time that it takes to sell a house right now in Lincoln as of June. So I love talking about the average sold price. As we look at it in Lincoln right now, it's down $21,000 from last month. It doesn't mean that your home specifically lost $21,000 in equity. It's an average of all homes for sale, but it's a good indication of where we're headed. So we want to look at the next few months of data to see how that shifts and if, it's, if it really is a downward trend. Right now, we only have one month of data to see. Uh, but every situation is different. So depending on the type of house that's listed, if it's a ranch style house, if there's a lot of houses listed on busy streets, there's a lot of factors. We also have the areas uh, that are selling and the time of year. So I don't think it's necessarily time to panic yet, but let's see what the next few months have. I'm curious, should you have any questions about the real estate market in Lincoln and what's going on right now? Feel free to comment below. I love to hear from you. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.